I'm here with Pascal Clivar, Deputy Director General of the UPU. Lots of things happening at the UPU at the moment. Uh, digital transformation. Tell us a bit about what the UPU is doing in this regard. We are trying to do our best in this regard because everywhere we are talking about digital. Early in our mandate, 2016, we had the digital agenda in our mind. So we had to speed up, of course, this agenda, not only because of uh, the pandemic, which came late uh, on our uh, mandate, but before that, we were, there was a lot of push to have this digital transformation be done. Of course, in the operational side, we had the push from the legislation coming from the US, Europe. They were expecting electronic advanced data. And so we had to, to, to faster our processes internal to make sure that we were able to set up product and services accordingly. We have also partnership like with World Customs Organization, with IATA, with other partners on the supply chain and you need uh, nowadays to be fully compatible with digi this digital era. So uh, we had to speed up our product and services side. On the other hand, of course, we are intergovernmental agency. We had to face a number of challenges now with the COVID, also with internal production. So we had to uh, speed up also our digital production of meetings. And we were able last uh, August to deliver the full digital UPU Congress uh, ever. Does this transformation at the UPU level reflect the, the transformation that we're seeing in the postal sector and in general with moving from being a letters driven sector to being a parcels driven sector? Of course everybody has in mind now what happened with uh, e-commerce and the booming and the tsunami of parcels we saw last uh, 16, 18 months coming. Uh, from uh, different parts of the world, mainly from Asia Pacific, China. Uh, but of course, there was a trend before and the trend was accelerated due to the economic uh, situation. So now we need, uh, and there is a strong need of all the supply chain to cope with this requirement. And today we are not only talking to airlines, we are also talking to railways, uh, to uh, this kind of partners who need also to be uh, at the same level of development in terms of digital um, uh, transformation. Uh, you've just mentioned supply chain and multimodal. Yep. So these are all important parts of this modern e-commerce offering and the post plays obviously a crucial role as having that universal reach. So what's next for the UPU with regards to bringing together all of this collaboration? The next step for the UPU is the opening up to other sector players. We are now in a world where the postal players are not only the postal designated operators. We are talking about players that are in, in the space now. Uh, Amazon is the best uh, uh, player for, for, th for that. No, but uh, without joking, this, this is the world we are in. Those players are moving a lot of goods uh, in the planet. And, and we need to make sure that we all together will be in the position to deliver the, the future. We are United Nations organization, we are also to cope with the sustainable development goals, and, and one of it is, is, of, is of course the sustainable development of the business model, the climate change, all these kind of problematics are within our agenda. Pascal Clivard, Deputy Director General, thanks for joining us on voicemail today. <laughs> Thank you.